Hey everybody, Kyrie 91 hanging out with you. Boy, oh boy, are we gonna have big fun today. Uh, closing out Let's Play Vandal Hearts. When we last left off, we were in this fight here against this jerk Dolph, and we are going to come after him full force and hopefully wrap this up. Um, I, you know what I just realized? We won that rune wand from uh, Zeno, and I forgot to equip it. Oh well. All right, so I know I have a suspicion about what Dolph is gonna do on the next turn. Um, he's probably gonna try to do that Dynamo Hum thing uh, because he's standing like right in the middle of us. So it's probably gonna kill Grog because Grog is a defense type, and that's fine. Um, so let's turn it over and let's watch him do stupid Dynamo Hum. Yeah, there was nothing I was gonna. I shouldn't have put Grog right there, but yeah, this is probably gonna kill him. This is a pretty powerful spell if I remember correctly. Okay, well, it's not too bad on Huxley. Oh. Bye bye, Grog. Oh, he survived it! Should I have Grog kill Dolph just because? Dolph is very close to dead. This is it for him. He will die on this turn. Uh. Yeah, you know what? To be honest, they did very much underpower him. I don't know why they didn't feel like making him a bit more challenging, but here he goes. Bye-bye, Dolph. Arg! And gained a level. <laughs> a rather meaningless level, but got it. And we win! And we get lots of money, apparently. <laughs> Kind of pointless right here to get money from this fight, but there it is. That's the last fight of the game. It's It should have been harder. Dolph should have had better spells. He should have been more challenging. They made that fight too easy. And I, I did use Plasma Wave. I know that that made it easier because I used it once, but still. It's finally over. Father. It's over. Let it go. Revenge for your father. I understand better than you know, but after you've taken revenge, nothing remains but a painful scar. Dolph, you can begin again. With your genius, you could do much good to help rebuild this country. Help this country. You still do not understand. This country is headed for annihilation. I'm merely accelerating and purifying. What a jerk you are, Dolph. I'm glad you're going to die. Now the world should be judged. This was my father. Dolph, don't do it. You must stop. Flames of judgment devour all you see. Devour our souls. Devour the world. I thought we killed him. Looks like we just hurt him bad so that he could do that. Alright, so he's releasing the Flames of Judgment and nobody can save us. It's no good. It keeps expanding. I'll use Vandal Heart to disperse power. No, Ash. It's too dangerous. There goes nothing. Ah! Oh, Ash jumped into it with the Vandal Heart Sword and now... There it is. Did it work? Looks like the flames have gone out, but... Ash, where's Ash? He disappeared with the flames. Oh man, Ash, why did you do that? That was a rather rash Ash move right there. But it was effective though. So, Ash was gone from the world, never to be seen again. Like this music. Mm. On the path to democracy, the wounds by left by the empire were deep and deep. As a result of the purges which left many dead, the government faced a difficult task in the new countryside thieves still make their own the new the countryside thieves still make their own laws. Yeah, but not Zukok, we killed him. And only the strong can survive. By the way, I think this song's in French. I've I've never listened to the lyrics before, but I heard her say uh, some stuff that I believe is French, so that's kinda cool. Yeah, this is French. Oh, it's Sarah. Amen. Kira, there's a flyer. 
I guess that's Ellen. Not Ash. But what about like Dolan and like Diego and Zohar and Darius? During this time, Ash's friends began to drift away. Lazy bums. Drift away. They should put that song in here. Oh, okay, cool. Dolan became a statesman and helped to rebuild Astaria. Good for you, Dolan. Let's see what happened to everyone else. Got, this is cool. I got a little epilogue here. I like this. I like this. It, it, RPGs need this more often. Vandal Heart. Oh, oh, that's it? We just hear about Dolan? They're just like, here's what happened to Dolan, and he's the only one who matters. That's awesome. Um, Guys, uh, I, I think they actually do. Yeah, Kira took off by herself in a journey of self-discovery. She's riding that horse up by the water. I really do appreciate you guys watching. For those of you who watch this game, this is one of my favorite games uh, from my tender years, and I, I'm glad to have played it along with you guys. Um, I don't know what's next on the list for me, but whatever it is, it's going to be some big fun. So stick around, uh, you know, for whatever that's going to be. Um, but let's keep seeing what happened to our, our friends. We've seen Dolan. We've seen Kira. Come on, let's get the rest of these. See you, Eleni Huxley. Clint, the new head of the security forces, waited for Kira's return. I guess that's who her is in this case. So, yeah, that's nice. What about Diego? There have been rumors the two will marry. That's cool. What about Diego? Let's hear about him. I'm curious about that. Um, if you have, if you, uh, if, if you haven't seen this whole series, I strongly recommend you go back and watch it. It's only 56 episodes of, of gloriousness. I know, because I was there for all 56 of them. Uh, and plus, Apocalypse 2012 was featured in a few of them, and I know how much y'all love him. I mean, I love him, so it makes sense that you would too. He's really cool. Uh, come on. Diego returned to Karachi to continue the family business. Look at him, he looks all sophisticated. I like that they're wrapping up everyone's like loose ends here. I think it's funny they started with Dolan and then just cut to the credits like that was the only one they were going to show us. game does have good music. Oh no, Ammon became Darius's apprentice machine maker. Oh man, where's Darius? Shouldn't he be like flying by in the background or something? Alright, who else? Come on. <laughs> Sarah got a job at a nearby bakery to be close to Ammon. She straight up told Ellen and she didn't even like Ammon. You liar, Sarah. Nobody believes you anymore. <laughs> That's funny. I hope they talk about Ellen and Huxley. Who are we missing? We haven't heard about Ellen, Huxley, Grog, Zohar. They, all they said about Darius, but they didn't show Darius. They just said that him and Ammon are going to be doing something. Grog and Zohar sailed all over the... What an unlikely pair. <laughs> I still sometimes get letters from faraway lands. Who's the narrator? Is Eleni the narrator? Who's narrating this? You get letters from faraway lands. Who is narrating this? Who is I in this case? Do, 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 do. Well, throughout the game, throughout each chapter, the narrator has been a male voice. So, it's possible the person narrating the epilogue is a different one. Huxley is always at home working on his stamp collection. What a nerd. Stamp collection. That's a hobby I don't even understand. I guess I'm boring like that. Narration. There's our narrator. Nigel Hodge. Ending theme vocal, that's cool. So that's apparently who sang that song we just heard. And this is the person who is being specially thanked. Right on. 
Oh, and that person too. Are you going to tell us who the narrator is that's narrating the epilogue though? Because I'd like to know. Okay, we didn't see Eleni anywhere in that. So I'm guessing she's our narrator. The days go by one after the other. Yeah, it was Eleni. Eleni was narrating. An endless procession of tomorrows. Yeah. But nothing new to write about. Hey! The Oak Arena. I know that song. Could it be? It is! It's Ash. Did Ash come back? Welcome back. I've been waiting so long. Wow. Okay, so I guess Ash showed up somehow. Well, the end. I guess that's it. Uh, once again, guys, thank you so much for joining me for this fun adventure. Be sure to stick around the channel. Lots more big fun coming your way. Not sure what we're doing next, but the only way you're going to find out for sure is by hitting that subscribe button and liking this video and sticking around Kyrie 091 channel for more big fun. Bye, everybody. Sweetie fun, sweetie love. We are fun, we the fun. Oh. Sweet fun, we for the fear. We fly on father down. We the fun, we say mm. love, feel the light. What a fun. We the fun, so be love, we fear. I don't think this one's French. I think the last one was. Hey everybody, this is Kyrie 91 If you enjoyed this video, or maybe you just like the sound of my voice like I do, consider subscribing to the Kyrie channel for more big fun.